I don't really don't want to take it apart. It's not because of anything you said. It's just pain in the ass. Because everything is so tight, which is good. Uh, I'm like my ex. All right. What I'm going to do is pull it off. I'm going to show you. And I'm going to put the flashlight down there because I don't want to pull this apart. Show you the flattened valve. And i got a cereal box over here. All right. Let's hit pause. Hey, don't mind. I got some crazy man talking in the background. Here's something also different. I have the barrel in there too. Uh, whatever the technical name is, don't mind me. Medications make it a little hard for me to know what the hell I want to say next. Even though I know what I want to say, it just doesn't want to come out. Here's, hope you can see it. There's the RTV, which I made it flush with the work I did. I basically took it down, right down to there. I used the file. I'm going to show you something, a little advice when using a file. See, a lot of people will sit there with the file and go back and forth. That doesn't exactly work. Actually, it slows it down. And the way the files are made, it's, it works one way better than the other. And you can see the work is smooth on the bottom of this, which has nothing to do with the gun here. I'm just showing you an example. And basically, you're going to do this with the valve. You bring it down and you go the one way. You can hear it taking shavings off. And it's a lot quicker than going like this, and it's straighter. That's how you're going to flatten down your valve. That's one way. Now I'm going to show you the valve in the gun. Okay, hopefully you can see it. Um, you can tell that the valve is flat and it's flush. And that's how that is. Most people will go all the way down above the ring. I left some room on top just because I didn't want to go all the way down in case I had any mistakes. So I just wanted to show you that the, it is flat in the bottom. Now we're going to go for the cereal box. Now what you're going to do is you're going to trim the uh, leave. Of course, it's got to have a unfired primer, primer on there, and you're going to cut it halfway down, and you're going to stick that into the back of the uh, 1377 or 1322, and it takes 10 pumps to fire the primer, and you're going to get a good shot. I'm bullshitting, by the way. That's just throwing that in the video to bust your ass. All right, I'm going to go to the cereal box. Okay, this is only one pump. This is about two inches away.